What's up guys, Mike here from Hammer Fitness again. Today I'm doing another topic of fear. All right, so I'm actually going to uh, scuba dive with some sharks today, Melbourne Aquarium. Now look, I hope uh, you watching, uh, you can definitely relate. I'm sure you've got either beliefs or any fear-like things that are holding you back in life, whether it be a belief or just something something that's at the back of your head maybe a phobia you're afraid of heights you're afraid of confrontation maybe a person you don't want to actually talk to because of a certain issue um, whatever it may be look you can essentially train yourself to handle not only stress but fear like tasks so whatever you're going through at the moment you can essentially train this by either directly or indirectly approaching other fear like tasks so for instance I'm going scuba diving with sharks it's a, it's a bit of a fear of mine going scuba diving but I've got a bunch of other fears now as soon as you kind of tackle uh, one fear you kind of build up a certain confidence or momentum of hitting fears because in a way they've all got similar attributes or uh, features like each other like for instance I want to work on my fitness so I could indirectly do that through either weights or cardio I mean there's a bunch of means and ways to do it so this is exactly how you can do it so today scuba diving with sharks and look it was a fear of mine as well filming in public but obviously you can tell that I've uh, work myself up with that I mean I get stares all the time from people either in their cars or people I'm walking around it's like people have never seen a camera before but nah it's all good all right so even doing that like I'm reasonably comfortable now and only getting more comfortable and it's just it, it just makes you realize like what the hell is the point and even having these stupid fears that are holding you back in life that are just limiting you from doing things you really want to do all right i'm going to jump in the aquarium soon have fun with some sharks here at melbourne aquarium now just got to wait for a brief to happen so as soon as uh we get the diving instructors to come out they'll grab us we'll go for a quick dive in the pool and then uh jump in with the sharks Alrighty, so it turns out I can't take my GoPro in the tank, but I can get some photos of the dive once I do go in. I'll be jumping into that big bad boy. It's a big ass tank. Obviously it goes all the way up as well and around. Apparently there's about 2.2 million litres. Fun times. Dives at four o'clock, going to get a feed. Done and done. So, scuba diving for the first time, that was pretty cool. I think, besides the sharks, I think the, the thing I was most scared about was actually drowning or losing my oxygen deep, deep down. So, it's just the stuff you shouldn't even really think about. I mean, it is a possibility, but yeah, that's the things that were going through my head when you're in those circumstances. But even still, uh, once you take the mask out of your mouth, it's not like it's the end. You can still breathe little bubbles out. Rule number one, which I just found out, was you're not allowed to hold your breath. Scuba diving. Uh, something to do with the nitrogen and oxygen in your lungs. Um, but yeah, that was pretty cool. 
it is like peak hour traffic in there there's freaking sharks and fish going everywhere to the point where we had to be guided through by the instructors they had to actually tell us to wait so the sharks would come through and then we'd get a chance to actually go it was quite funny they all the fish have right away since we're in their home so we've got to respect them obviously but now that is uh, one of the fears conquered or completed now I want to go actually get my certificates um, and go scuba dive in the wild so I think that's my next move just like the tandem skydive I think the next move is uh, skydiving by myself so if you dare I urge you to post in the comment section one of your fears and one way that you're going to tackle it whether it be something like what I just did or something indirect post below post your fear get it done guys it is amazing of a feeling to uh, actually do it and get over it um, and just have fun with it so see you guys in the next video